Okay, so this is the first Nello boat that we've had in here. I've seen the Marantz. My friend's son actually is one of the sales reps for them. At least I think he still is. So it's definitely a unique profile on the boat. And uh, the ones I've seen, not here, but you know they all have these kooky paint jobs that look beautiful until you have to fix it. So, um, let me open this up as we always do. And that ring to the right is the O-ring for the inspection port, which looks like it's broken. And then, um, it's also got the railroad tracks, I guess you call them. You can see the wheel and how the track has the hump in it. So the customer is really distraught over this and uh, it's pretty nasty for sure, to say the least. So if it's not sitting right there on the slings, it'll buckle in half. Now onto the stern and I gotta tell you something, I've never seen anything like this before and it's absolutely brilliant for someone who has to fix this stuff. So it actually has a rubber cap right there. Here, James, flip that over for me. And on the bottom of the cap, that's foam. So it seals it up. And uh, the deck actually has the bolts or the nuts, I guess, underneath the deck. And then you can see that little knob and that knob is connected to a, or is screwed onto a piece of all thread that holds the fin in. So I gotta tell you, somebody over there was thinking. And to add on there, um, another unique thing that they have here is that where the foot stretchers are, that nut you can see, that's onto a rail system. So you can literally put your foot stretchers anywhere you want exactly and precise. No shark teeth involved. Pretty smart. So now in addition to this, uh, I, when I went to put it back together, the inspection port, you can see right next to the rail there on the seat deck, it's rubbing and it's the, uh, the metal clip under the seat. So we're gonna check that out for her because that would be annoying to listen to that. Okay, onto the hull here now, and there's a little nick in the cut water. And um, it's a little dusty. It was on the rack. This is a big job, and I'm gonna be doing it myself. So it looks like somebody went to it with a scuff pad or something right there and there. A little paint chip there. And then, unfortunately, I gotta have the sling right here, but you can see how the hull is really in a bad way right there. You can even look down at the edge of the deck and you can see how it's you know, distorted. There's a little paint chip back here. And then it's just as bad over here. This is actually a little worse. And I can tell already, because I looked through the crack, that it's extremely thin laminate. I mean, like thin, like maybe two millimeters, one millimeter. Pretty sure it's a foam core. So there's some scratches in the paint here and there. There's a little distortion where the paint, the red meets the black. No big deal. So there you go.